What's good, legends? We've got three brand new Gran Turismo 7 dailies to check out. So let's hook in and see if they're a good time. Kicking things off is daily A. We've got six laps around Sardegna windmills. That's right, people. Group B machines required for this week's daily A. Let's get cracking. If we have a look at the global ranking, there's only two cars ruled out for our options today. Quattro S1 and the WRX B rally car. Daily races, go! False start check is on. Just be sure not to jump that start. Started third. Could have went heaps quicker in the top trial, I think. Shout out to our friend of the channel, uh, Lanzi. It was five seconds quicker than us in the uh, in the Audi. So, obviously, time on the table. Well, we have a minute twenty or something like that. The Subaru up the inside. A bit of ghosting in this one, which. I think ruins the fun, ruins some of the fun, uh, but super keen, I like that there's some rally in the dailies. I do enjoy the rallies, I know many of you don't. Let's be honest, there's no WRC. But it's still a good time, I reckon. Let me know what you guys reckon. That was one corner I was a bit slow in, in the TT. This was probably another one. Because you just probably only need to lift. This is long, you need to brake. So you're not in the rocks there. Be wary of the jump. Be on the brakes before the jump. In my opinion, it'll stop your sailing. On into the hay bales. All right, we're up into P2. Oh, don't know if we're going to be out there. That's good. How's it going? Many of you probably know the uh, Scandinavian fleet. I have no idea if that is any quicker in this game. Is it? There's many of people who took before me. It doesn't. It feels a bit icy, like you know, rather than gravel, maybe. I'm, I'd love to uh, hear what you find. People out there reckon we went purple. There you go, four seconds quicker than my uh, TT time, so... It's probably a problem with doing only one daily and rating it and judging it as well. The whole feeling of the, uh, of the race might change, but that's what we're doing. So here we are. Oh, 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 we're in the wall. I don't think I've told you what I'm driving. How rude of me. If it's Group B, I normally go before focus with Colin McRae. Livery. Oh. And oh, they're all out of shape. They fang past us. All right. Break at the marshal here on the right. Carry the speed through. Get back over to the left. Little lift. Down the hill, gun it, gun it, gun it. Oh, we're bumping, we're bumping, we're bumping. Got a break for this little on the left. I'm gonna have it back in here so you're not drifting towards those stones on the right. Rock face. On the anchors before that little ridge. That way we can gas it out of the corner like that. There we go, we're ghosting. We're ghosting, we're ghosting, baby. Hook this in, you can take this flat. We'll 
it in. Right, stay right to those hay bales. The second lot of hay bales is our brake marker. We're on the anchors. Down the third. Keep it nice and straight. Get it up this hill. I break hard there. Wipe off the speed for this next 180 left. Power on out of there. Go, my friend. Go. Not the quickest. The leaders put the foot down. Lift a little. I do anyway, just to keep it kosher. Go for uh, most of that race. Who knows? Thank you, GB GT. GB, GB GT. So we jumped up to second in that one. CRB as well. Good length for daily A, eight minutes roughly. A nice change of combo as well. And a bit like last week's front wheel drives at Laguna Seca, I think this one is well worth slapping and give this three out of three cases. Daily race B next, boys and girls, and group one machines are required. We've got an eight lapper around the high speed ring. Times one fuel, times one tire, not too much to worry about there. Racing mediums required. Some deeds you need to worry about is the partial tuning. Partial suspension, partial differential gear, partial transmission, and downforce as well. And as always, brake balance is adjustable. Have a go at this global ranking board. The Nissan, the Nissan, the Nissan. The top 100 is the R92 CP. A clear standout that we're prohibited from racing in. Here we go, gang. Race B. Group one, so let's send it. Two uh, familiar faces from last week, Noddy being one of them. I think Magoo's in here somewhere too. The truth be told, we've already done this one and we had a little incident. Nothing, just an incident. Now it's really important you stay off the barriers in this. SMO so gently. We are wanging here. 300. Oh, little slipstream gets us to three. We gotta stop it though. And we're tied. I don't know if you can work out or if you had worked out what we were in from the noise this thing makes. We are in the Mazda. We'll say if unsure on setup, just take all the aero off. Start from there. Really should have thought about that one better. Ooh, never gonna be as quick as him going up the inside. Oh well. On the lap five.
best. I've done that corner, I think. Sector time certainly says so. Oh, no, I don't need the barrier. That's going to happen to you a bit. Completely out of our control. So you just got to grin and bear it. Try and do to them what they did to us. No luck though. Mm. All right, two to go. He's six. Six more be on the card. He's fifth. He's fifth. Three point two. It's not a long lap. Green flags though. So. Oh, sketchy on exit. Sketchy, and I think that's a penalty for fifth. No, not the barrier. We're not looking at it. Don't look at it. It's been fun. I've had fun. Been a bit of a laugh. We'll get to what I really think in just a moment as we cross the line. P7, I don't even know what happened. Everything's going so fast. Maybe a few less penalties and we'd be uh, P5 or P6. Up one position, not a bad race as we check out some of the race highlights. This was good fun, people, good fun. Is it a daily B? Personally, for me, I think this is more of a daily A. It was good fun, a good laugh, but maybe a bit of a meme race. You tell me, you tell me. As I said, I did have fun, but will I be coming back to this one? Probably not. So I give it two out of three cases. Off to Le Mans next for Daily Race C, five laps of Circuit de la Sar. Group 3 Machines, which I think has caught most people by surprise. Racing softs are the tyre compound. Fuel times one, tyre times four. That will be something to keep your eye on. Brake balance, the only car settings adjustable in this one. And one stop is required. Over to the global rankings and my silly little rule rules out a car that I was super looking forward to having a drive of. Off we go. Daily C coming at ya. Didn't do a time trial for this one. Starting from the back, we were second last, we already had a disconnect as well. And can you tell by that gear shift what I decided to pick? It's a very distinctive. Oh, is that a pen? Get the radar up, get the radar up. Oh, we're tight. It's going to compromise us. Oh, no! No pen. No pen. But. Shine run onto the straight. It's 
skip all the other four. This is what I chose. Let's see how this thing stops at 300. I'm breaking early because I've no idea where to break. Not early enough. Just not hard enough, probably. Well, that's okay. We're side by side with the Lexus, we'd rather be in front or behind. One down. The Lexus looks alright compared to this. Really got to stay with them, stay in the slipstream. There's another Ford Gorn skis. Oh, and out of the room, Magoo. Magoo uh, is becoming a bit of a regular in these uh, daily races. Got a bit loose ski. Oh no. Oh no. That's a pen. Let's go skis. Go. Crash in front! I think we box this lap. It's that time, I reckon, it's that time. Box, box. Make sure we pull it up, no LJ entries. There we go. getting more confident here. Two to go. Ah, we got that all sorts of wrong. I've got to say, I don't know if this is a rubbish race or if this was a rubbish race. Like, just this one was rubbish. Be keen to give it a go in something else, in, in the Ford, being the meta, which lack of options, possibly. But uh, this track, I personally can find a bit boring at times and take the chicane out, it gets a lot boring. Our way through the field, up six posies for eight position. I don't know how I feel about this one. As I said during the race, I don't know if this was just a bit of a boring race or if this actual combo, this week's daily C, is a bit of a snooze fest. That's the trouble with only having one shot and one shot only. 
and it's easy to throw baby out with the bath water. Early doors, it looks like it's very limited on car selection. Yes, there's a mandatory stop adding some strategy, but for me personally, this may be unpopular. But this is somewhere between rubbish and meh. You know? And if I get the chance to play it some more, it may grow on me, but right now, after one go, it's one and a half catches for this week's game to see. Thanks for checking out this video, legends. There's plenty of fun to be had in this week's dailies. Make sure you are subscribed to the channel so you don't miss out on any of the live streams. And until next time, stay rad.